Good morning and welcome back to Daybreak. We're here at Maxwell's Pumpkin Farm on Bell and McCormick and I'm here with the owner, Larry Borger. How are you doing this Good morning. morning. I'm great. Good to have you out here. Thank you so much. And so as you can see, we have a variety of pumpkins right here. They're all growing here locally. And so can you tell us about the growing process? Sure. We plant about 20 different varieties and we plant somewhere around the 1st of June and had some great rain this year uh, that helped us a bunch. So we've got a great crop and, and it'll be a lot of fun. And as you can see, we have one from like the size of a mandarin to these big ones. I can't even pick up. <laughs> They're, uh, they weigh a ton, I'm sure. That's right. They a lot of uh, pounds. And so actually throughout the month of October, they have different activities and field trips for the kids sure. here. During, uh, we do field trips with school kids during the week and then open to the public on the weekends and have three weekends left to go. And one of the things that kids love to do is jump on this giant jumping pillow, which we're about to go because we can be kids too, right? Sure! <laughs> That's <laughs> right. I'm trying to be to be kids too. This is pretty fun, but coming up later, we'll be showing you some more cool activities here at Maxwell's Pumpkin Farm. There's a corn maze right here behind us. You can't see right now, but we'll be lighting it up coming up later on the show. Back to you guys in the studio. Hey guys, we're here at Maxwell's Pumpkin Farm on Bell and McCormick, and I'm here with the owner, Larry Borger. And so Larry, you got Tons of activities going on here, and we're here right now at the obstacle course maze. And so, can you tell us about this one? Sure, lots of lots of fun stuff in our obstacle course maze, and I think you're fixing to try one out here in just a minute. But a lot of fun, a favorite activity for sure. What kind of things do you run into in these? Oh, we've got several climbing walls. We've got a suspended tunnel that you climb through. We've got a, a deal called claustrophobic that you have to kind of fight your way through. Oh no, a lot I'm claustrophobic. Of fun. A lot of fun. <laughs> kind of scared of that one, but I'll try this rock climbing one really quick and see how challenging it is. We could just take a few steps and see if we can climb up. How long does it usually take people to climb these and go through the maze? Well, it, everybody varies. It, you can go at your own pace. And it could be kids and adults and everything. Sure, too. sure. You can have fun and become a child again here. And so you guys have also, um, well, the giant jumping pillow and a corn box too. Sure, lots of activities. Like I said, we're going to be open three more weekends. This Saturday, we'll have a live band okay. that'll start at 12 o'clock, the Prairie Dogs. And that they've been here for uh, the last couple of years. A lot of fun. It'll be a great day. Okay, and so it's $10 to get in? Ten dollars admission fee, children two and under are free and uh, so yeah just it come the weather looks like it's gonna be great. Sounds good thank you so much Larry and so if you guys want to find out more information you can visit maxwellspumpkinfarm.com go to their website and check it out and you can also come here yourself and check it out uh, uh, between Bell and McCormick and we'll take it back to the studio. Well, it's good to see that Jessica has that coat on because we are starting off the day on a chilly note. Hey guys, so we're here at Maxwell's Pumpkin Farm on Bell and McCormick and we're going to be painting some pumpkins pump here, this, just like this one. And so this is Harley. And so can you show us how to paint some pumpkins here? Like this one is a little bit more simple design that you guys can do at home. And so how do we start? Yes, we started off with a Sharpie and then we're going to move on to acrylic paint for filling okay. in the black. So we can get started yes. on one really quick? I'll show you how to start and then you can go ahead and try yourself. Okay. Okay, so you start with um, the flattest part of the pumpkin and then you're going to paint or er, draw a circle to start off with and then you're just going to do a little circle inside of it. And then just fill it in, okay? Yes, and then Another one on the other side, and then you finish off with the nose. I'll go ahead and let you now, try that. Do you fill in this with the Sharpie? We fill that the, in with the acrylic paint. Acrylic paint. Yes. Okay. And then try to draw that nose over here. Yeah. <laughs> Not quite the same, but it's, <laughs> it's kind of there. And then the mouth, kind of like a scary mouth. There we go, I need <laughs> some artwork and then we have some acrylic paint? Yes, and I'll go ahead and let you try to fill it in. Okay. This is a purple instead of black, but you can go ahead. Yeah, a little creative. Alright, so we fill in right here. And 
get the idea pretty much you fill in the rest of the parts and there we go it's not that hard you guys can try it yourselves at home thank you so much and we'll be taking it back to the studio thank you